mother, your biological mother. Tell about the mother, the woman, the delivered that woman. Right. Tell about the insanity from that she was insane. She had a mental problem, your biological mother. Huh? Yes, yes ma'am, I'm telling you. Because the people told her to abort you. <laughs> they told her to abort you. And the woman, as crazy as they say she was, she had sense enough to say, and then I also heard somebody like Anne, 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 Angie, like Angie, Angie, the aunt, the aunt named Angie, Angie. Sheketu I came today to break the curse. I came to break the curse. I came to break you out of that bottle. For I see like a bottle, and I see it floating on a river. I see it floating on a river. With your name in the portal, and I see caravan de Hushra for the man. I see a man going to prison. Going to prison. A man went to prison. I'm way back now. I'm way back under the Kishka. Way back in time. The man associated with your mother. Go to the Boshkara. <laughs> My biological father. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he, yeah, yeah, he went to prison. And the enemy has been fighting you, Rosh Kanahanda, oh for so many years to try to stop and block your inheritance. Is this true, sir? Is this true? Yes. Kandelebo Satalaba Kandelebo Sat. Huh? 30 years. For 30 years. But I'm also seen, in addition to the inheritance, I'm also seen like land, like land. I'm, I'm talking about, I'm in a, like in the spirit, but I'm in a drone and I'm flying over acres and acres and acres of land. Oh my Jesus, what is 42 acres. 42 acres. Prophesy. Rosa Pakata. Prophesy. Rosa Pakata. Prophesy. God say, on the paper it say 42, but can I tell you it's 50 acres of land, that water, there's some land that run along the water, am I talking to you sir, river runs. a river that runs around the proper side. So Hala, who's into you mommy? His father. Your daughter's father. Yes. Lamanda Rabashata Rabashata. Robo Shatta, what does the letter B has to do with him? His last name is Beckford. Okay. Oh, prophesy! Oh, Come on, prophesy! Oh, Karabanda Robo Shatta. I want to pray for your daughter, Karahinda Lebos Katarabasate. Because when your daughter, step forward for me one minute, mommy. God is going to deliver your daughter. Hallelujah. God is going to break the chains off of her. Ah, you have been praying for her? Huh? Shabra Candelabo, it's okay. You're in total shock. Are you understanding me? Listen to me. The girl, the mama is in total shock. The girl don't even look like the girl. I'm talking from tattoo to this to that to everything to piercing to everything. But it's like the girl look like she been through a washing machine. Is this true? You are shocked. The girl does not look like the girl. Like something entered the mind and this girl is like Marokko Talabaskata. But the thing that happened to your daughter is not just happened today it's happened at 21 are you understand me that a spirit entered this girl but I see as the spirit entered the girl the spirit amen of rejection the spirit of false identification are you understanding me because the girl would have been in a season looking for this man looking for this confidence looking for this support even though the girl knew amen, what the situation was but a time and a season of transition for her when she needed the father the most the father was not there is this true? he, ha he hasn't been in her I mean constant in her life from like five five there's somebody you're praying for somebody by the name of Sydney 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 who's that my daughter that's your daughter and I see like there's a man in front of a yard raking a yard mm. raking a yard now you would have seen this image a man of a man raking a yard just recently my son, my son. 
Ah. Huh? My son. Oh, shit to the, that was raking the yard. Yes, I'm out of here. I don't know who this person is, and I don't know if they're connected to you. But like, I saw someone like was working to place like a, I want to say like a restaurant, or like a food place. Like a food place. Girl, huh? My baby girl, she, she's a chef. She's a chef, okay. Said the Lord, you shall lose nothing. You shall lose nothing. You shall lose nothing. And I see the angel of the Lord holding up this mortgage paper. Karabashat, are you hearing me tonight? Yes. Holding up these documents, holding up these mortgage papers and putting things in order for you. But the Lord said, tell you, praise God, because I don't know who Sydney Father is, where Sydney Father is. I have nothing to do with you people. But God said that there's a blessing I have for Sydney. There is a blessing I have, an inheritance that I have for her. And God said the inheritance has been stolen and has been held up for long enough, that said the Lord. And God said, I am going to, he said, tell Sydney that I am going to release everything into her hands that belong to her. Who's Valencia? Valencia. And Val. That her brother's name is Val and her niece's name is Valencia. Yes, ma'am. I haven't even seen your brother. Well, his name is. Mm -hmm. What happened to him? Because, like, he ran into, like, a mode of, like, depression. It's, it, like, something broke in his life. After my father died, he was a bishop. After my father died, the whole family. Just went into a remission. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Val saw a lot. Yes. Val saw a lot and a lot happened to him oh, in those places called the four walls. But you know the people didn't do you people right. No, they did. What happened is they took everything. Everything. From them. I see like a wicked board. I say, when I say wicked, do you mimi, mommy? Do you understand me? The board is so wicked. They granted they they changed documents. They dodged papers. They robbed you people. And then they said there's no money. There's no money. The burial was even a sham. They did everything in a cheap fashion. They did not want you people to prosper. Val was broken by this thing. Because he revered the man. He revered him. Reverenced him. And everything shambled. He was also supposed to wear that collar. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Very gifted. Yes. Am I still prophesying here? Yes. I'm talking about gifts like, you know, there's somebody that have a gift, but then there's somebody that have gifts. He is yes. multi. Yes. Multi. I don't know if your name is Julian or you are related to Julian. Can I hear Salabanda come? Julius. Who's that? It's me. You. Yeah. But what does 1979 mean? That's the year I was born. That's the year you was born. Prophesy! Hallelujah! And the Lord said, on the day that you was born, 1979, I am in that place there where your mother was. And I'm seeing a boy in the womb, but I'm seeing in the, the umbilical cord around the child's neck. I'm seeing a boy in the umbilical cord around the child's neck. Are you hearing me, sir? Yeah. Huh? I was born on the bathroom floor. Uh huh. And the cord. And the cord. Was around. Yeah. Huh? Prophesy. Prophesy. Come on, prophet. As your mother takes into labor, crash sudden like the thing happened so like sudden, and the Lord showed me. He said, from the day the baby entered the womb, the enemy was shooting arrows at this boy. Kind of Julius, kind of shut up with this woman. Kind of shut up for some reason. She knew that she could not give up on you. Kind of shut up, but I saw the Lord funding your life.
and there was an older woman an old woman I don't know if it was a grandmother a godmother or a stepmother but I see old woman but this is where I see now because the poison is already in the grave the poison is already in the grave and the top of the tombstone is not square the top of the tombstone is round it's oval shape do you know what I'm talking about? it's my grandmother your grandmother the tombstone is not square yeah, the tombstone is uh, yeah. come on prophet for the woman prayed a prayer concerning you before departing this world. Are you hearing me? Pray a prayer. My grandmother was my best friend. Your best friend. She prayed a prayer over you. And she blessed you. Are you hearing me, sir? As my name is Matty. 